It was an evening filled with laughter and tears. A gathering of friends, women from all walks of Havasu life, celebrating the accomplishments of the many, as well as those of the one. Women with willpower named their Woman of the Year this night, one of many who lend a hand. My name's Connie Alexander, and I get the privilege to serve as the president of Women with Willpower. Thank you, thank you. First, I want to welcome everybody for taking the time out of their day to attend our second Woman of the Year. And we are extremely excited to recognize some absolutely amazing women in our community. Women with Willpower is a 501c3 charity here in Lake Havasu. And we raise money to help women who have been met with an unexpected financial need that just cannot be met elsewhere. Women that are basically falling between the cracks. There's many great organizations in our community and a ton of resources, but sometimes you get that one situation and it just doesn't fit. And that's kind of where we are able to step in. With the referral from one of our sponsors or one of our donors, we're able to go out, assess the need, and help in any way that we possibly can. We are limited by the amount of money in our bank account. We don't have any paid staff. Everybody with this organization is a volunteer. And 100% of the money that we grant to women stays in Lake Havasu City. The nominees were recognized one by one. Alana Cole, Jillian Danielson, Joanne Sakula, Kimberly Finch, Linda Seaver, Marty Nash, Sheila Barker, Sarah Pennington, Then, the three finalists. Connie read the nomination letters of each of the finalists. I would like to celebrate and nominate my coworker and friend, Diane Page, as an outstanding and amazing woman. Diane is the librarian at Havasu Pie Elementary, and her heart for children is extraordinary. Then, from third to first, the winning names. Diane Page. First runner-up. Sarah Pennington. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, and ladies and gentlemen, our winner, 2017 Woman of the Year, Linda Sieber. Linda Sieber, with a long history of helping others personally and through the Community Health Foundation, was then crowned by her predecessor and received the love of the crowd. Women with willpower, helping one woman at a time making our world a better place. Jim Matthews, Abbasu Video News.